The Cystic Fibrosis Community is invited to participate in a series of videos and podcasts on individuals that are living, breathing, succeeding with cystic fibrosis. This podcast, I believe, has been made possible through an unrestricted educational grant from Genentech to the Boomer Esiason Foundation. I believe people with CF should have a strong support team because CF is a very difficult disease to suffer alone and it can be very isolating. You know, the daily challenges of CF can be hard and you need people there to encourage you and to love you and to support you and to remind you, you know, why you're doing everything you're doing. I have friends that I love hanging out with because my CF is not a big deal to them. They make me feel like a normal person. It's important just to know that people are there for you. They're there to help you and take some of the burden off. You may have some difficulties and, you know, with medications or you might need help uh, just getting around or getting to the doctor. To know that people are there, whether it's your family or friends, that's just kind of a nice cushion to have. There are highs and lows with cystic fibrosis. How I deal with the lows is when I'm feeling kind of down at various points. I just kind of try to push through them. And for me, a great form of therapy uh, is exercise. On the days that CF gets me down, I pretty much have a hard time getting out of bed. But sometimes to distract myself, I'll watch a movie, or sometimes I'll even listen to sad music and cry because it's good to get it out. I deal with the downs in CF by remembering there's always ups, you know, there's always going to be downs. And it's not just CF, it's, it's everything in life, there's always going to be downs, but you just, you get through them one day at a time. And I think hope is really important. You have to have goals and something to hope for and live for. My priority right now is to stay healthy uh, and just celebrate life on a daily basis. I believe cystic fibrosis makes me stronger because having to stay on top of it has helped me develop a personal discipline about getting things done that has affected all the areas of my life. It makes me resilient and makes me know I can do anything. You have to endure obstacles and learn how to work through difficult situations. So now when I'm faced with everyday life situations, it's really quite easy. I realize how precious life is and that every day is a gift. So I try to do a lot. And I believe sometimes I fit more living into one day than most people fit into a week. I'm more determined and I'm a stronger person. I have run two marathons and more than three dozen half marathons. I have plans to ride my bicycle across America. I can credit having cystic fibrosis for developing that aspect of my personality.